oncologists now, um, if they treat with chemotherapy, they know what they have to worry about. They know that they have to worry about hair loss, nausea, um, blood count declines, and they're ready to look for and be ready for those. But the immunotherapy has a different set of adverse events, and these are related to um, immune attack where it shouldn't, or autoimmunity. So you can get attacks like skin rashes or colitis. Uh, the most worrisome one is pneumonitis, sort of inflammation of the lungs. And physicians now are having to learn about these adverse events, become familiar with them. So there's a learning process going on. The PD-1 in the C immunotherapy is pretty simple. It's a half hour infusion, that is a, a needle in the vein, um, after which you can leave the hospital. So it's not a complicated therapy. It's not as simple as taking a pill by mouth, but it's not a month long stay in the hospital and a near death experience. Um, it's a pretty well-tolerated treatment. And um, I think this treatment is simple enough um, to be accepted and used in community hospitals and that the regular um, physicians are going to have to become familiar with the different spectrum of adverse events in immunotherapy.